What's up guys, this is Kellen from Wizard Tricks and today is not about Wizards Unite, today is actually Pokemon Go Community Day. So this is what we're doing today, we're going to catch some Trap Inch, uh, which is going to be really exciting. I hope I get a handful of shinies I'm out at the harbor and hopefully we got some good stuff going on, uh, some good spawns today. We'll see if I end up staying here, there's a huge event going on, I'm going to get to check it out, see what's happening and then go from there. Alright, let's see what I got. There's my trap inch, first shiny trap inch. I'm getting way too close and it ran. Okay, let's see if it pops back out. There we go. Let's see if I can get it on AR mode. Total miss, like blends in with the grass. It was not good planning. There we go, let's see if I get it. One, two, three. Oh, it popped out. Oh man. All right, bad throw, bad throw. There we go, there we go. Let's get it. Okay, one. Wow, man. Okay, we're gonna we're just gonna use a golden raz on this thing since I have plenty of them, anyways, from all the raids. All right, come on, Pokeball, come back to me. It's like the most difficult shiny catch of all time, right here. This is like the hardest time I've ever had. All right, one, two, and three, and that is it. First shiny at Ventura Harbor. Check that out at Trap Pinch. Let's see the IVs of this thing. Praise. And that one's pretty good. Um, horrible HP, but a pretty good attack and defense, which is great. Um, I will say that we have a nice sun out, so we are getting a ton of weather boosted trap inch so hopefully i'll get some more shinies but also some nice iv trap inch as well and of course hopefully i get one that's both maybe i'll get one that is in the 90 percentile of ivs for pokemon we'll walk around a little bit more enjoy this awesome weather and find some more shinies let's do it all right, so out walking around, community day is actually almost over, and I thought I would have a ton of shinies by now, because normally when I play, there's about 14 shinies that I end up getting if I play for a full three hours, and I didn't come out until the last two hours, so I missed the first hour of community day, um, but I only have two shinies so far, which really isn't a lot, and <clears throat> in general, I have noticed that there just hasn't been as many spawns for uh, for community day as typically that I've seen in the past, which is really interesting and I think has really affected the ability for people to get spawns. Everyone I've talked to hasn't gotten hardly anything. Um, literally, I think the most I've heard of is three today, which is really low for community day, especially at where we're playing. Normally, um, people, it's super common for people to get more than 10 shinies in a day. And I don't know if that's necessarily a positive thing or not a good thing, but like I said, I've only gotten two which is which is a little bit of a bummer with only a couple a 20 minutes left in community day only having two is a little bit of a bummer because i do like trying to fill up my pokedex uh with with shinies uh of each evolve form and it's not looking good so far for me to be able to finish that today and have all three uh, evolve forms of this so we'll see i got 20 minutes left hopefully i get one more so come like hope for hope and pray that i get one more Oh, an egg is hatching, 5k egg, and there you go, a seal, there we go, which is hilarious because I got some cool stuff coming up uh, for you guys that has a lot to do with that, so um, check out what else I was able to do at the harbor during community day. All right, so let's go in here to my shinies. I only ended up getting two, uh, but there you go, some of my other shinies, but I am going to go ahead and, and evolve one of these uh, all the way up, that way I can get the special community day move set uh, which i actually don't even know what it is but uh, i'm sure it's decent usually the community day moves are pretty awesome uh you do have an hour after community day to get it uh so you have plenty of time i really like that that they didn't make you do it towards the end the first handful of community days you had to do it during the event which was such a bummer you couldn't like actually figure out which one you wanted to do that with so giving us an hour afterwards is awesome uh, and of course my favorite part is actually seeing the evolve form in shiny which is really cool this is actually a really awesome shiny evolve form um, all the colors in this all the changes are really awesome so there you go dragon tail earth power I guess is the the moveset and pretty decent um, attack and defense like no HP there 
uh, but but not too bad, not too shabby, right? All right, community day is over and I wasn't able to catch three trap inch. I only got two, which is a huge bummer. Like I was saying, there was definitely a lot less. Uh, but that being said, I still had a good time. Obviously seeing friends that uh, I haven't seen in a while is really the best part of community day. Uh, so you can't beat that, but I have to say, I don't know if it's bad or not. You tell me, let me know if this is bad. But I actually am glad, uh, I guess, well I would say, Community Day today gave me appreciation for Wizards Unite and how much I actually enjoy Wizards Unite. Of course I love Pokemon and I was out here playing today and it was great um, to be back and playing, uh, but it's just not the same as Wizards Unite to me anymore. I really do enjoy all the features that Wizards Unite has, uh, so I'm glad to be back playing. All right, hope you guys enjoyed that. Hope you guys enjoyed getting all of the shiny flag on. It was a, uh, it was awesome. Let me know how many shinies you got. I only got two. I know a couple other people got, the highest I ended up seeing was six uh, for someone else. Uh, so how many shinies did you get? Did you guys play for Pokemon Go? And how did you guys like uh, my Pokemon Go videos? Do you guys enjoy me doing um, some of these? I'm thinking about doing more of these for the community days and stuff like that. So definitely smash that like button for a Pokemon Go video. Uh, and of course, subscribe to the channel, really appreciate it. And if you're just joining my channel for the very first time uh, because you're a Pokemon Go player, thank you guys for watching. I do play Wizards Unite, that's my main content. So um, definitely check, take a look. And if you play casually, definitely check out my videos. If you have any questions, let me know in the comment section. I will definitely help you out or get you connected with a community um, close to you. There are a lot of them growing. So definitely drop a comment in the description. But we're gonna get out of here and see what else is going on for uh, my Saturday.